10 months of tears and training. Trinity High School senior Tyler Beauvais is seen here practicing for his first baseball game since his life was forever changed several months ago. A horrific car crash last summer killed his mother, father and brother while they were vacationing in Utah. WFM News 2's Jessica Winters talked to him between pitches tonight as he prepares for his first game since the accident. It's hard to believe that Tyler Bove has suffered such traumatic loss in his life because today he was walking, throwing and catching with the best of them, something doctors didn't think he'd ever be able to do again. 18 year old Tyler Bove standing steady on his own two feet without any sort of support. Pitching, catching and yes, even smiling. A month long progression from a devastating car crash in Utah last June that killed his mom, dad and younger brother. My um, back surgeon said that I probably would never walk again, but I am walking, so. Proving everyone, including the doctors, wrong, his physical setbacks aren't really setting him back. Even in, when I was in Utah in therapy, I was, I mean, working on my swing during PT and stuff, like kind of just one arm swing. But look at him now. He was cleared by doctors and coaches to play at Thursday's home game. Tyler's first game since the accident. I'm going to feel a lot of butterflies. I, know, I think I'm going to be nervous. He's made major strides, but he's still not fully recovered. I can't run. That's a big thing. So I'm going to have, when I hit, I'm going to have someone run for me. If the baseball crowd is anything like the football crowd, Trinity High will show up in a big way for Beauvais. Even when I'm on the field and I have to walk somewhere to get the ball, they cheer me on. I don't really know how many people are going to be there, to be honest. But he is sure of one thing. His family will be looking down on him, watching him throw that first pitch. I'll probably look out into the stands and like just picture them there. But I know they're there, so I mean, you just got to think of it that way. Thursday's game is at 7 p.m. against Andrews at Trinity High. On a scale of 1 to 10 to rate his excitement, Tyler says he's at an 11.